Hello, my name is Jordan Shadowins, and I will be your instructor for this course. This course is about how to set up E-Trade version 1 API in Node.js. I did provide you guys with E-Trade's developer website. You go to developer.etrade.com slash home. You will find a couple sample applications um, that E-Trade provided in Python and Java. The official sample application for Node.js has not been released yet, which is why I'm making this tutorial to make it easier on you guys. If you want to make a trading bot or have your application interface with E-Trade, this tutorial will help you jumpstart that process. The first step is to request individual access to, to do that, you'll need to log into your E-Trade account and click on the customer service link. Then go to the message center section on the customer service page. And at the bottom, you'll see send us a message link. Once you click on that link, make sure you let E-Trade know that you want to request access to their E-Trade version one API. And you should get a response back fairly quickly from them, letting you know that your consumer key and consumer secret should arrive in three to five business days. I do want to note that the consumer key and consumer secret will be for E-Trade's sandbox environment. If you want your Node.js application to interface with E-Trade's live, live environment, you will need to fill out a form to request that. E-Trade will explain that further to you once they send you your consumer key and consumer secret. The next step is to download Node.js. To do that, you'll go to nodejs.org. For beginners, I, in the next video, I'm going to walk through on how to create a Node.js uh, application. If you are more of an expert, you can go ahead and uh, skip the next video. That, that's going to be it for this video. Uh, if you guys have any questions, send me a message, especially if you're having trouble downloading Node.js. Just send me a message on here and get a hold of me, and I, I'll be able to help you out. All right, guys, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next video.